G'day, I'm Doug from Meat and Livestock Australia. Welcome to the Rare Medium Academy Masterclasses. Today, we're gonna to talk to you about selecting, preparing, and cooking Australian beef and lamb for your barbecue. Okay, today's cut we're looking at is the beef short ribs. This comes from the forequarter of the animal. There's only a little bit of work to do on this cut today. We need to just take off a little bit of that fat across the top, turn him over, and we're gonna remove that bit of membrane from underneath there that covers the rib bones. That part there actually curls up, makes the beef curl up when we're cooking it. Then it's all ready to go into the cooker. Okay, we've trimmed off that little bit of fat off the top. We've got rid of that membrane underneath it. This cut is one of my favorite cuts cooked low and slow. So Chef Sam is gonna show you now how he's gonna create that perfect beef dish. Beef short rib, as Doug said, what a piece of meat. Let's get it on the barbecue. First step, kosher salt, cracked black pepper, onion powder, garlic powder, paprika, and cayenne pepper. We're gonna mix it all liberally together. Then we're gonna get in all those crevices of the meat. Let's get our beef short ribs into the Weber smoke fire. We want to get the, the smoke fire at about 130 degrees Celsius. Then we're going to stick a probe right in the center of the meat and we're going to take that meat to 65 degrees Celsius. Don't forget to spritz it every half an hour with your apple cider vinegar, beef stock and water spritz mixture. Next step, we're going to pull it out when it reaches 65 and we're going to wrap it tightly with foil and put it back in the smoke fire until we get an internal degrees of about 95. We've taken the beef short rib out of the Weber smoke fire. We've allowed it to rest for a good 20 to 30 minutes. Whilst we've been doing that, Julie's made a vibrant summer salad that'll accompany the dish. She's then cut the cut right down the intercostal to accompany the salad and then served perfectly for your pub, club, hotel or restaurant this summer. What a versatile cut. You can cut it straight down the intercostal and use it as part of a serving platter for an American barbecue plate. Or you can take it off the bone and shred it for a taco. As a salad topper, it's got versatility like no other cut and it's slow, low, gelatinous taste, really is a win with the customers.